after that last Brookhaven update where they added that weird post-apocalyptic home, another update came out. Again! Yeah! They're dropping fast! And in this video, we'll be seeing everything that was added in this update. Everyone that's excited to see what was added, please leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel, as I always bring these to you guys. You can also write red in the comments below, just to confuse everyone in the comments. This new update brought us... Wait a minute! Who's this orange weirdo over here? Okay then! These players are indeed going to be all kinds of weird! Something new was added in our vehicles tab! Yes! A new vehicle has been added! We can scroll down a bit and we'll see something new right there! It's an ice cream truck! You can even open its lid up to sell them to players! Wait! Is someone approaching our truck? That little guy kinda looks like me, right? But he's angry for some reason! Hey! Do you sell ice cream? Little guy! There's a big ice cream sign on top of the truck! Then yes! Of course! Give me a chocolate one! Well, I was trying to show the people the update! But guess I have to sell. Here it is, buddy. Now that you got that ice cream, you owe me 50 bucks. 50 bucks? That's so expensive. Well, if you don't want it, then don't eat it. Give it back. This little dude literally comes up to my truck, gets his ice cream, and still complains. I ain't paying that. Are you being serious right now? I hope you're kidding. I don't think you have a choice in the matter. He's getting away. Get back here, you rascal. You owe me money. You need to pay for that. Let's just leave that kid alone. But I guess I lost 50 bucks today. That rascal. He's literally just going away with my ice cream. If chocolate lovers are gonna be like that, I won't sell that flavor anymore. Anyways, as I said, it has a lid on this side, but there's something on its other side too. You can see that we are able to click right there. And if we do, we're able to write something on the side of it. Alright, I hate deadbeats. Just so people like that little guy are aware. But you can also see that there's another thing we can click on here. And if we do, the whole truck is gonna change. What was an ice cream truck is now a hot dog truck. This is so cool. Oh, the sign is here too. So it's both sides. So people can come up to you and you can sell some hot diggity dogs. Maybe you'll get rich from those hot dog sales. Who knows? There's even the condiments here if you need. This one looks awesome. And from the hot dog truck, we can also become a taco truck. So you can do the same as before, but now with some nice little tacos. Just be careful, I've had some bad experiences with deadbeats. There is actually another variant of this truck, which is actually a candy truck. You can sell cookies, chocolate, whatever your sweet tooth needs. Let's have a look at what we have inside. Looks like we got donuts, cookies, and some chocolates. Is that a client? Oh, no. She went away. Looks like I'm not selling that well for now. Let's see another one, since no one seems to want candy. The last variant is just a regular truck. Nothing really interesting about it. Girl, are you just teasing about buying something? So that's what this truck adds to the game, which is pretty cool. Let's see how it does at max speed. Wait a minute. Did I just come upon a rival truck inside my town? Hey, what are you doing stealing my clientele? You didn't even try to talk about it first. No, no, no. You're the one stealing my clientele, buddy. What are you talking about? I started this thing first. You weirdo, I've got a gun, so you better stop with that. You don't even come try to say that you were the first. That's right, run away. You chicken, that guy was crazy, out of nowhere trying to sell to my customers. There's another guy selling stuff here. Dude, there's just tons of people trying to sell stuff around Brookhaven now. There's only room for one. I'll crash into all of their trucks. These guys are ruining my job like that. Wait. Did I just flip it? That was incredible. Now for the next thing on the update, we'll have to go over here. In Brookhaven Stables. Because there is some new stuff around. You can see that this is what we call a stable. Here is where horses normally stay at. To start, let's go to our inventory. Get our prop box. There will be tons of new props for us to play with. One of them is the horses. And with that, we can put some horses here in the stable. We can also customize it. You just click on this thing right here and you'll be changing it. It's now a cute little white horse. Now it is a big black horse. Look at how beautiful it is. We can't really see his eyes very well. 
since they're black too. After that, we got the regular one with a blonde mane. Then there's this very nice gray one. And after that, we got the regular horse we've seen before. Oh god! What's happening here? I put the horse up there by mistake. Let me just take it off. I love the addition of horses for the prop box. Let's get these horsies back in the box. For our next addition, we have to go to the hospital. You can see that right beside it, you can find Brookhaven Cemetery. Those that pass away are buried here. And in this new update, we actually have a grave as a prop. Normally, we have about six graves in this place. And we can just add a new one here. Let me get one more. I think another two would be good as well. And with that, you can for sure think about some pranks for players. Like putting a grave in front of their house. Actually, let me go and do that right now. But before that, I should disguise myself. Let me make myself very small. I'll just go walking there and put the grave in their house. So, is there anyone here? Oh, it's open? Okay then. We just gotta know if anyone is here. Because I'm loving this grave idea. Now, where's the owner of this place? Oh, she's outside, tending to her yard and everything. That's so cute. But sadly, I gotta troll you now. I'll place a grave right here and even some other ones in there. She won't understand any of this. And if I'm not mistaken, I can hide myself right here. Now, whenever she gets inside, she'll just find tons of graves around her house. Actually, I think one is more effective. I don't want it to look like I'm trolling. I want you to think that someone died here. Awesome! It's right in front of her door! Please don't take too long a time, lady. I have a surprise for you. Is she grilling some hot dogs? Can I maybe get one? I even put some spiders on her grill. She's even getting scared! Let's look at what she's doing! Oh gosh! She saw me! She also saw the grave! She must be so confused about it now! I'm gonna go up to her and tell her that it was just a prank! Hey lady! It was just a joke, okay? Oh, I guess she's a good sport about that stuff. But our troll wasn't really that good. She didn't react at all. Let's see if there's anyone inside this place now. Well, that looks like a clear no. What about this one? Is anyone there? Dude, why does no one stay at their house anymore? Now guys, I finally found a place. And there's a family living here. A baby and its mother. It's time to get to trolling. Let's go on upstairs. Looks like the mother is asleep. I want to just lie right here where the baby sleeps. Hey, I'm the new baby of this place. This is my space now. Oh gosh, the mother has woken up. Hey, how's it going? Well, that feels like not too well for me. Guess she didn't want more kids. <laughs> if we can do something in this mansion. I'm not sure who's the owner of this place. Do you want to adopt me? I'd be a great kid. To start off, I want to eat something. You can give me fruit, veggies. I'm good for everything. Damn, she deleted the house. Dude, it started pouring out of nowhere. I gotta find some shelter. I'll just get into this place without thinking twice. Oh, the owner is right here. Hello. Just so you know, it's raining outside and that's just why I'm here. Dude, she still banned me. These people are not cool at all. So, getting back into what was added. There was a prop pizza added, so we have that to use now. For example, let me get into this place. Oh gosh, this place is on fire. But that doesn't matter. We can just sit around the table and get some pizza here for us to eat. We can also change it to some other stuff. These lattes and cookies. There's also some nice takeout burgers. A box full of hot dogs. And that's what we have. I think it's some very nice stuff. We can also put some barricades. We can just put these on hallways or windows to barricade ourselves. And this is how it looks. The owner of this place is gonna be so confused with all of these. I can also change it to some other looks. Like this brighter one. Then we have this white one. And after that we have these that are a lot thinner than the others. After that we get back to what it was at first. This one I like very much. We control a bunch of players with this. You are also now able to put a pool in your house. It's a very nice little pool for you to enjoy a hot summer day. Just sitting around drinking some juice or something like that. We can also change it to this carpet right here. There's also this cute one for you to use on the beach. And then this one that looks to be more for kids. That's what this pool can do. Oh damn! The owner deleted the house! Another cool thing about these new props is that we can literally spawn smoke. Yes! 
You heard that right. You can make people question. Wait, why is there smoke coming out of there? This is for sure a nice trolling mechanism for us to use. We can also change it so it becomes this red smoke. This one just feels evil. You know? Next up is this nice looking purple smoke. I love this one. Then there's yellow. And green. Then to end off, blue. After that it goes back to the regular smoke. Something else that was added to the game is a little detail to the houses. If you've ever felt like you don't have that many clothes in your closet or in your home in general, we can fill it up with these clothes that come with their hangers. You can also change it up to get other colors, like these pink and white ones. There's basically these two selections. Wait, is someone here? Is someone bathing? I heard the sound of water running. Oh, someone left the tap open. That's so irresponsible. Don't do that, guys. Want to know another cool thing that was added? It's a little thing you can put anywhere you want in Brookhaven. You can see I'm at the hospital. Let's go to the x-ray room. I think it would look good in here. We can literally put a sign on the wall. Nice. You can see that this is an open sign for your stores and stuff like that. But if we click its button, we can even change it to the agency. This is a bad omen. If we click it again, we get a bigger agency symbol. This for sure will confuse the people in the hospital. But that's just what it has to offer. We also have the option to put some trash on the ground. So yes, I can just put a bunch of trash in front of someone's house. I know I would be mad about that. If we change it, we get a little chest with some food. After that, we got a toolbox. You can actually grab the tools, by the way. We can also get this little water spout. I think it's pretty. Then we can also have this big door. I think it also has some trolling potential. After that we just get back to the trash. There are also some other kinds of signs to put on walls. Like this bright star. We can change it so it becomes a yellow one. Then we can also choose a heart for the lovebirds out there. This one also has another color. This pink one. After that we have an arrow. I think a labyrinth with one of these would be cool. Of course, the next one changes where it's pointing, and then we also have blackouts. Then we just have a white star. And that's about it. But you can't say that there's not a lot more to work with now. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this update. The videos on screen right now are as good as it, so trust me and give them a watch. Leave a like on the video and comment below what did you like most about this update. Don't forget to subscribe for more content just like this. Have a good one!